Okay. Now that everything is set up, it's time to do the thing. Almost everything's set up. I gotta put my light on. There we go. Now it's all good. Okay. Picking up where we left off. Oh, the mid zone. Okay. What what did we have to do? Oh yeah. Fix my car up a little bit. Mm-hmm. Put the racing stripe on. Can I make a battery jumper? I can make a battery jumper. One more thing on the... Oh, we already have a battery jumper. Okay, I already have these things. Repair putty can't make because I have no chemicals. Hmm. The car is about as repaired as I can get it to be. Eh, just one, two, three, four, five, six things not working 100% to efficiency. It's fine to me. All right, so we need to... I need the engine. I guess I'd throw some repair putty on that thing, right? If we were so inclined. Hey, Maxi. Yeah, no problem. No problem. Alright, what was I doing? Is there anything I can do available to? Light replacement kit? Flare gun. What's a light replacement kit? Let's make it. I have a feeling I'm going to need it. Just seeing how I crash headfirst into everything. Can we make you? We need... Oh, it's plenty of stuff. This. How many breachers does it take to... Oh, I need a bulb. Can I make a bulb? I can make a bulb. Light replacement kit. But how you doing, Maxi? Yes, you can. You can do it in all the places. Alright, so I have a light replacement kit, a jumper. Med kit goes there. I think maybe I should put the med kits on me. And the extra foods over there. I'm doing all right, friend. I'm doing all right. Plasma and plastic. Oh, I have stuff on me. What's happening here? Is there a fax coming in? We've been trying to reach you about updating your tickets in... Uh, okay. Oh, Maxi. <laughs> All right, let's. Why is my dome light on? I have quirks. How many do I have? I have four. Let's get out of here. Oh, I gotta plot a route. That's right. I figured out a quirk. Yep, 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 yep. Okay. So. Close this. Dome light goes on. Okay. So, um... Dome light? Where is it? The new MMO tech? What do you mean? Dome light switches on. Hood open. No. 
Hood is closed. Dome light switches on. Star Citizen, Star Citizen invented a new tech called server meshing? Really? What does that mean, server meshing? Oh, when it's closed, it toggles. There it is. Fixes. I need a mechanics kit. Fix it over here. I fixed a quirk. I knew there was something with my dome light, so that's two quirks. So they invented a technology? That's kind of neat. I mean, they had all the funding for it, right? Oh. No. We want to go to there. Now this is all stormed up. We don't want to do that. Well, we're going to have to go here now. Let's go through G8 to that one. Server meshing. Oh, we're already good to go because I have the auto parker on. Let's go. I've always wanted to get into Star Citizen, but the whole thing about it being an alpha for like 10 years has kind of like saved me off a little bit from like jumping full force into that <sighs> we're gonna have to go to this one cannibalize cars is even a way to remove parts intact why is it so dark okay I shoot at you in server 1 from server 2. Server 3 bridges both. It sends the XYZ info of my bullet to server 1, which makes a bullet seamlessly appear at the right coordinates. So, like, they're offloading... So, like, they offloaded... Do they have a server, an independent server, handling all calculations and stuff, and it sends it over to, like, the, ori the origin one... It's basically cross-play with servers. That's what you're telling me. Is that what you're saying? Oh, picked up a bulb in full. That's weird. I don't know if it's... I'm grasping it entirely. Need juice. And there's juice on the road here. Ken, how you doing? Take care of this. Good. Good. 
It's always good when someone's doing good. What game is this? Uh, this is Pacific Drive. Oh, God. Get in your car, get in your car, get in your car. It is a uh, explore open world kind of exploration roguelike sandboxy extraction game. Please leave me alone. I was just trying to scavenge the car for parts. Um, it's pretty cool. I am enjoying it thoroughly. There's a lot of systems at play with this game. Turn off the lights. Park. Hopefully they... It, at nighttime, yes, this game is kind of terrifying. It's right there, what I need. See it across the way. They need to just not follow me. Thank you. I don't have a scrapper. Oh man, what am I thinking? Run. Run back to the car. So basically in this game, you are driving along. You get sucked into a an alternate dimension kind of thing, I think. Or just a... Oh no, not the left rights. Um... And I have to find my way out of here. No, don't you dare. Get off me. Get off me. Oh, my. Get off me, man. Everything hurts. And I want to cry. Alright, get out of this spot with me. What? What is happening? How long have I been playing this game? Uh, this is the fourth time, so about 12 hours now? Turn those off. What is going on with my radio right now? I did not turn on my radio. Okay, I also need to craft some items. I don't have enough parts for a scrapper. Okay, we're going to be in... Tr I forgot to do that. So I forgot to make some things before we left. That's on me. Uh, I need some more plastic. Yeah, that's not good. All right, I guess we're just going to go about on the map here. And the inter interesting thing is, so like, when you pick your mission, that like the route that you want to go, in order to progress beyond where you did things, you have to like go through old areas, which are now more volatile than they were before. So it's like, it's like a weird risk reward system like I don't have to be doing this but I'm going to because I'm stubborn put that back there take that run away okay I need to get to this sirs oh great get off garbage. Uh, yeah, so we're here. I don't know what this blue thing is. We're gonna go there, and then we have to go here to escape. So. Alright. Doop-de-doo. 
Yeah, and then when you get when you get to a zone you haven't been before, you have to do this weird extraction mechanic where you have to f like drive into a rift portal. But as you're doing it, there's a storm that's closing in, like Fortnite storms. So there's like a lot of stuff at play. Plasma. Hey there, uh, Revenge. How you doing? Hmm. Radiation. Not gonna take damage for that. Let's go forward. This is like a good idea, right? Just driving your car off a cliff at night. Uh, I'm playing Pacific Drive. A weird, fantastic exploration survival roguelite. We're driving is a huge portion of it. No, it seldom is. It's never it's never safe, but I, I never learn my lessons. And I don't have enough parts to create a scrapper, which I need to harvest things from cars, so I have to find my way to that blue dot. A little bit of off-road here. don't like are these blue electric fields. Uh, is there a safe way around it? Yes. And as you go through, you find um, upgrades for your car, cosmetics for your car, a whole bunch of stuff in this game. And I, like, you would think, with all of the things I just said that this game is, that it's just so weird that it doesn't work but everything works, and I, I don't understand how they got it to work. Love my voice? Well, thank you. Thank you very much. All right, let's park the car. Turn off the lights. Impact hammer. Here we go. Was oh, there one of those nasty storms? Or oh, the nasty storm coming through? And break it. And so break it. Pick up all the bits. And now get back to the car. The car is here. Okay. Uh, hi, Bacon. I'm good. How about you, sir? It's just a regular storm. If I make a right at the road, it should be good. Yeah, right here. Here we go. What's in the shed? Please have plastic in the shed. Thank you, Ken. I appreciate it. Pry this open. Checking out new orders. What are there any new? Or I want a spoon. Do I have any plastic on me? I don't have any plastic. Battery, food, scraps. Uh, what's the new? What is the new order, by the way, Bacon? I thought it was still to, like, defend Menkent and the other one. This storm is ripping through here. Oh, check. I thought you meant you already knew. Fry bar. No. That, that was the last order that I thought it was. What game is do I play? Literally anything. Uh... So the backstory of me and streaming, I was, I always loved indie games, but for some reason I got really absorbed in Overwatch for like five years, and I'm not a PvP person, but for five years straight I played only Overwatch, nothing but Overwatch, and it destroyed my mental, and I 
didn't like where I was going. So then I decided, hey, let's just play all the games you never, ever got around to playing because you were so absorbed in Overwatch. And that's what I've been doing. Basically just trying to conquer the enormous backlog of games that I have. Get off here! Go on, get! I played Fears to Feather. No, I can't even say I've heard that. What kind of game is that? Ooh, chemicals. We need chemicals. What's up here? Okay. I don't know if I have enough plastic to make a scrapper. I probably do now. Something sounds weird. Something sounds weird and I don't like it. Storm is... Oh, it's a... Uh, abductor. Right. Fantastic. Please go away. Turn off your lights. Let's get it in the back. Okay, hold on. Scrapper. Done. Now let's go back in here and get the stuff I missed. Uh, you computer for electronics. It's a fun, scary game. It's realistic. I'll have to add it to the list. I have a list of games on Steam. I think... Do we have the connect set up here? Hold on. Uh, here's my Steam games list. Oh, it might not go to the right one. Oh, it is going to the right one. Nice. Okay, so... I have that stuff. Is it going to drop it on there? I don't know if it's going to drop it on there. Alright, so anyway, I have a Steam list of games that's probably at this point over 700 games. Uh, my goal is to conquer the backlog. What is this? Hold on, what is this? This is new. It is... Mysterious audio, audio recording. right behind me. Alright, so we're also near what I need to get. Some more energy. This is going to make things fun. I don't really need this, but I'm going to do it anyway. chamber in front of her. She does not appear to breathe until a ball of light okay. appears out of thin air. The sight is tremendous. So now we have to get out of this place. We need to go to immediate. here. The gathering audience roars with excitement and spontaneous applause. On Dr. Turner, okay. only a tightening of her lips indicates that she hears the audience at all. Dr. Turner and President Koch pose for a picture, but she does not smile even then. That picture is the image splashed across newspapers and science journals. Speaking of games of you rising, should I look at the making server or not? Not yet, because I don't know if there's enough interest besides, like, myself at the moment that would want to really dig into that game. Then she recedes into the bowels of a government research facility. What game, Ken? She's never seen again in public. There are scant appearances here and there in Blink and Miss and promotional videos. And Blink this game? Fodder. I don't know if I'm good at this game yet. I'm just, I'm just okay at games in general, I want to say. 
survival games is something I've been getting uh, into recently. And I know the do's and don'ts. There's cardinal rules you have to follow. This is going to hurt me. Uh, we made it. Over. Okay, I'm ruining my car. Ooh, stuff. Stop. Park. Get out. Alright, let's see if this works. Give me your bolts. Give me your stuff. Yeah, there's like a brief tutorial that starts this game out. And it's like the most brief tutorial besides Helldivers, I want to say. Um, but you kind of get the idea of how to play it. Like, run around, collect things, avoid certain uh, areas, hazards, and stuff like that. Scrap it all down. And then we pick it all up with my vacuum. Until the vacuum breaks. Is that everything? No, that's not everything. I think that's it. Yeah, we're all good here. Yeah, no problem, Shockwave. Good to see you. Yeah, if you want, I will be on... I'm on every Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, and Friday. Um, 7 p.m. ish Eastern till about 10 p.m. Eastern, about three hours when I stream. Um, currently we're going to be playing through Pacific Drive until this wraps up, and then I think I want to I want to get into Planet Crafter. That's a, a survival game that just dropped. It's like about terraforming a hostile planet to being livable for humans. Uh, it was in early access for a couple of years, and it just hit 1.0. So I kind of want to get into that. Because that one also scratches a lot of itches I have with games. Okay, this is... Don't crash. Don't crash. There's a shed somewhere. There's a whole bunch of cars I could try to salvage. Yeah, um, Planet Crafter has a demo up. So if you want to give that a shot, you can see if you want if it's your, up your alley or not. So... Hmm... What is this building that's nearby? Oh, it's it's a science building? Let's go. But where is it on the map? There it is. Okay. Hey, Frank. Have I tried Dead Link? I can't say I've heard of that one. There are so many games that I don't know about. And I want to play them all. Down. Give me those pieces. I forgot there's a button I could I could just literally push one button to transfer all and never ever do it. Here. Take all this. Computer. Break them down. That's everything? Yeah, that's everything. I'm about to burn out my vacuum and my flare light. Okay. Uh, good. Get out of here. Where's the car? 44 meters this way. Okay. Then we get out of here and go on to the next part. And then you're going to see what it is to extract in this game, and it is... It's something. I'm not sure if I like this auto parker, to be honest. So, Dead Link is basically a twitch shooter, and you have a chainsaw leg. So you're the girl from, uh... What was that? Grindhouse. Was it Grindhouse? Yeah, the Grindhouse double feature. It, what, what's up with all these bunnies? crashed into a rock. All 
Alright, so I got them. Good. Uh, what was the one with the... What was the, what was the Grindhouse double feature? I can't remember. I didn't watch them. That's probably why. FPS Fest is going on on Steam, so that... Okay. Nice. Yeah, so this is where we start at our garage. And we have to eventually get to here. But to get to here, we have to clear these zones out one by one. My plan was to go here, to here, to here, and then path that way. But this stuff here makes it a very an unstable area. So now I'm taking the side route to here. But then I have to clear this out completely, extract from it, go back to here, and then run through it again. It's a weird system, but I like it. So let's go. So it'll be 7.30 in the morning, so hopefully it's not going to be dark anymore. And I could stop being scared. Let's see. Uh, ooh, this is not good. Battery sapping, perpetual stability. Wait a minute, so battery sapping? All right, Revenge, you take care. Stop. Thank you for stopping by and chatting it up. And uh, maybe I'll see you tomorrow. If not, hope you enjoy uh, your day. Okay, so this is an armored truck. Can I even take... Oh, I see what it means. Oh. My battery is just frying right now. Twin Peaks, that is that is a good call, Frank. That is a very good call. Let's open this up. Give us some juice. Put this back in the trunk. I have one shot of that, one shot of this, not a whole lot of that. Okay, we're in trouble. I didn't fuel up at all. I still have decent fuel, but I can't use my lights. My lights will sap really quickly. That is a not... F I have to get one more anchor. Okay. This is dark. Are you kidding me? Three of these guys? No, 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 no. Turn around. Turn around, please. I would like it very much if you turned around and didn't bother me anymore. You're kidding me. Off-road. If it was one, I would have just drove, driven through, but three of them is trouble. All right, Ken, you take care as well. Appreciate you stopping by, and like I said, maybe I'll see you tomorrow. Or another day. Doesn't have to be tomorrow. They're all behind me now, so I don't want to use my battery. So it's a good thing that it's starting to, uh... The sun's starting to come up. No, no, nothing to apologize for again. You go do what you gotta do. Shed here. My hood is screwed. I th think I have enough parts to make... Repair, buddy. Hold on. Thought I heard something. I do. Alright, we're gonna repair the crap out of my hood. What else was screwed? Um, uh, the headlight, the bumper, the side pa- So headlight, bumper, side panels. That's what we gotta fix. 
headlight. Bumper. And then my side panels. Yeah, three would have been, uh, I don't know, maybe our definition of fun is very different, you and me, Mr. Mugen. Uh, that's the TV. Break it down. Ooh, pressurized cartridges. We don't see them very often. Light. Anything, anything, anything... Oh, backpack. Nothing. It's in here. Okay. Drop everything off. Can I make a new... No, I can't make a new hand vac. Wait, I can. Oh, because I need a tier 2 bench. That's why. I'm going to need a new impact hammer because... There we go. Good. What is this game called? This game is called Pacific Drive. Smiling back, Evan. Indeed, Mujin. It fixes everything. There's another... There's another structure on the other side of the road. Please don't let random radiation happen. What is that sound? Just take everything. Give me the food. Impact hammer. Let's go. Apparently, it doesn't work that way. I have to figure out how that works. Maybe you break into it somehow, and... You break the door out? I don't know. Nope, not this way. Right, go back to the car. Yeah, it's Pacific Drive. It's a very interesting, atmospheric, spooky kind of roguelite exploration game uh, with driving. Tons of resource management. Crafting, survival, all that stuff. It's, it is a fun time. Road. I have to get at least one of these anchors. Then we can open up the link to extract, and we want this. Oh no. We don't like this area right now. They're still there. Those are like the weeping angels of Doctor Who. Or if you look away, they get closer to you. my vacuum. Is there anything else here that is salvageable? Yes. I don't know if I'm close enough to trigger them. Like, I'm, I'm, I don't know if I'm close enough to trigger them to start attacking me. Or walking towards me. 
There's a chip in here. Yeah, they kind of have been stationary the whole time, and I'm grateful for that. Uh, actually, we need to get out of here. Put all this stuff away. Good to go. These noises, man. Oh, great. The, uh... The anchor I have to pick up is straight into this. Right? Of course it is. Of course it is. Oh, God. Falling down a hole. So we want to get back up that way, but I feel like we're gonna we're just gonna punch it here. Close the door, close the door. Go, 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 go. No, no, no. No, no, no. still on me, isn't it? Alright, it's off. That's right. That's right. Okay. I have just enough energy to get out of here. I've got 2.1 bits. I mean, we should, we should get more. We should. Do I have to? No. Could I just extract out of here now? Yes. Where's the fun in that? This also appears to be one of the bigger ones. Here, run. What happens if he catches you outside the car? Oh, the... What, the... The abductor? I don't know, I've, I've never... I've never scienced it. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. This guy. I don't like this guy. Alright, move, 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 move. Oh, get away from me. Get away from me. Isn't the flying guy Santa? I, it's what I called him the first time I saw him. I thought he was Santa Claus. But they're anything but jolly. They're very cranky. I, I, would, I would say they're more Krampus than Saint Nick. and other parts now. Yeah, the handy vac is actually really useful. Backup gear. I 
knew I had it somewhere. I just wasted resources before. Fantastic. What game is this, uh, Seven? This is Pacific Drive. A survival craft, uh, roguelite exploration game with a ton of driving and atmosphere and spoopiness, and I love it. I'm still fairly early on in the game, though. Hey, Cry. How's the drive going? It is... It is progressing. Kind of. I now have enough juice, I think, to... open up the way to the next stage, which is where I have to go to progress the story. Uh, there we go. Okay. That's a ton of material. Ow, I smack myself every time. Alright, so now we have the juice. We have a ton of juice. I'm here. 50. I feel like that's the best exit. Because it's on the road. You know what? That's that's what we're going to do. We're going to do this to the road. But we're not going to link up yet. We're going to get this one. And then we'll back up. And then we'll uh, get out of here. Because the more stable energy I bring... Oh, crap. I need to get out of here quick because the storm is coming. Oh, no, 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 no. Hey, now, that wasn't cool. I almost drove my car into the lake. Or the river? Probably the river. Okay, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Seize it. Park off. Go. this, I'm in too far. Okay, so we have to back up. We have to go back through that. Kind of got to go into that storm a little bit. Well, I think we'll be fine. We'll be fine. This is fine. Car's not all that banged up yet. Turn around here. And we do the thing. Get out of here. Even though it's a fairly straightforward path, my anxiety is still through the roof. Oh, and that circle's closing in. That's closing in pretty quick. We're fine. We're fine. We just gotta drive on the road. Yeah, we got this. It's right there. It's right there. 
But holy heck, does that close in. Okay. There we are. And it's trapped in. Base. 4.2 stable energy is nice. Huh. I'm marginally impressed. Not bad, newbie. Okay. Things to do. Check the dumpster. Thank you, dumpster. Next, recharge the battery. Recharge myself. Uh, refuel the car. And then, repairs. I mean, we're not that bad. One, two, three, four. You know, if I make one putty. First off, I have to get... Where's the box? Where's the chest? Tardigrade count stable at 100 TPM. Starting the experiment. This is it, people. A new chapter in the history of science. Okay. Alright, vacuum. Let's empty the trunk. This too. Put everything away. Stuff goes down here. Now, store in the fax machine, okay. Frequency file part one. And so that was that weird radio transmission thing that I saw. Huh. All right, now it's upgrade time. What can we upgrade? Yeah, I've been using the chemicals and it really shouldn't be. That's a jump jack. This is more fuel on the side. This is for what? Insulated doors? No, I want an insulated hood. Insulated panel would be what I need. Flare gun. What's this? Electrician's kit. Oh, the electrician's kit. Less precise than a cutting tool, the Liberator will nevertheless cleanly and carefully remove individual sections of a vehicle by precisely placing small explosive charges. <laughs> Interesting. Enormous energy that anchors generate gives off an unmistakably unique signature that could easily be detected with the right equipment, and this is that equipment. I think maybe the electrician's kit, because I've seen part, parts out in the wild where like, hey, if you had this, you could repair this door lock, and then take everything that's inside. Maybe this thing here just to get more tools. What else is available? Uh, flare gun, side fuel tank, jump jacks. I mean, I don't think I don't think I want anything else. Let's see what we learned. What did we learn? Liberator. Oh, those take those crystals. That's gonna not be cool. Electrician's kit. Make one of those. I want to make a turbo light engine, but I need a lot of stuff. Steel sheets. Gas cylinders. And a lot of those scraps. Where do I... Oh, I have to blow up the, the citizens. Those people. So maybe I do make the flare gun.
Maybe we do. Dude, that takes care of those 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 dudes. Why not just make this? Just toggle everything. Doors, utilities. I mean, I could know how to make them. Nothing wrong with knowledge. I feel like I want the jump jacks more than I want the uh, auto parker. Jump jacks. Can't make them need gas cylinders. Okay. Oh, it's one of those. Cool. So this is going to go in the utility part. In the utility part. The rest of this goes here. Now we plot our course. So we just did oh, butthole. So we're gonna have to go through this really unstable portion here. This is where I just was. Well, we're doing it. Atmospheric shifts, anomaly density, radiation density, zone storm. That's what those things are. Resource density. Eerie darkness. That's what I'd like to not read on my... Yeah, no... Okay, we're gonna do this and we're gonna get wrecked. Um, the car is. I probably should do something about this car. I just have to find a really like res like chemical resource heavy area. And not destroy my car. This door? Yes, yeah, this door. That's everything. Yeah, we're good. Let's put you in here. You're for the fix it up stuff. Uh, radar gun. I don't have a flare gun. And we also wanted a new hand vac. Because that thing's really useful. So many tools and goodies. Something tells me, though, that I've already got a, uh, I already had a vac. Uh, the vac, what it does is it sucks up all the pieces on the floor. So, like, if I go around a car and I just chew up the panels and the doors, I, I take a second to walk around with that vacuum going and it, pull, and it picks up all the parts on the floor. Uh, fuel can is full. Oh, yeah. Ow. Oh, yeah. I want to see one thing. Can the putty be used to repair the engine? Yes, but barely. That didn't do much. Okay. I mean, it's something. Something's better than nothing. 
And now we're at a party. Which is fine. This is gonna break in a second. Uh, I have... I think I actually had a flare gun in the trunk. Yeah, I had a flare gun in the trunk. Smart. SMRT. Maybe we take this out. This out. Put these in here. Yeah, this goes on me. Do I have a flare light? I do. I would like to swap these two, please. Thank you. Okay, and now we go about our business. The bobblehead's kind of funny. I like it. I like it a lot. See, we don't have to go here. We could go on any of the paths we've chosen. This is the destination. Abductors, spark towers. Uh, swift storm disruptive discharge, touch and go. It looks like this one we're going to have to just drive through. So we could just... Uh, this can be better if you had a steering wheel. No, because you need to like change your like your perspective like your vision of everything so you would need to use the mouse it would be weird to drive like be driving and then you just have to be like clicking everywhere with this one at the same time while operating the gas it's weird to me i, I never liked the gas pedal setup for for driving games i'm fine with mouse and keyboard <laughs> Go, oh, there's stuff. There, well, there's no resources. No raw resources. This will get us different energy if we wanted it. I think what we need to do is just gun it and run it. Why did that only take me halfway? Oh. We're just on the highway. And I guess if we wanted to stop and chop, we could. So here, Mujin, this is what it does. I'll go around and I'll just chop up all the stuff. Those sounds, man. And instead of going around here spamming E, you just do this. You got all the stuff up. It makes things really simple. So no matter what, you always have like this half of a... Uh... Okay. 
you don't just go straight to the uh, the long part. You have to like go halfway. I gotta figure out what the other three quirks of my car are now. This should give me enough to make some things. You're gonna have a ton of gas. Lots of stuff. There we go. Inventory full, fine, we go to the car. And we're back. that was everything yeah so this this is a very nice spot it makes me uh, everything about this game right now is like yeah here's a nice quiet calm area you're getting a ton of resources um don't get used to it because everything's going to go bad it's going to go sideways that's what i feel is about to happen Everything about video games has trained me to, yeah, especially because this, yeah, they definitely did a little different here. Spooked. Okay, that's just a regular car. Take it. No tires, no tires. Stuff in the trunk. There is no trunk. It's vacuum. Is that crappy vacuum? There we are. Well, that truck had a crappy vacuum in it, so I'm just going to use it till it breaks. the heat issue that we were apparently were having in this room. So now I'm not dying of like heat exhaustion. I gave it a test earlier today playing Helldivers uh, for about like an hour. Temperature did not increase or decrease. It just stayed the same and I was a happy boy.
That game has a range to it. Funny if someone yelled, hey, that's my car. <laughs> what the heck are you doing? That's my car. Yeah. Well, the fact that somebody would be saying anything, too, because you're very isolated in this game, except for the people over the radio that they help you out every so often. That would be something. Hey, Charles. Oh, no. Sorry to hear that, dude. Hopefully, it's not for too long. I'm glad that this is somehow making you feel better. We have two buildings. And then... You get away from me! of hazard this. How does a day and night cycle work in this game? Um, every place you go to has like, it's going to take three hours to get to that place. It's going to take six hours to get to that place. So based on what time of day it is, it just cycles through based on the Pacific Northwest in whatever month of the year this game takes place. I forget which one it is. What month it is. I have so many tools. Two flare guns for some reason. Flare gun here. This guy there. I need to make some room soon. We'll do that like so. Turn off your lights, dude. You're just eating up battery juice. So there's one scrapper down. I don't know how, how, like, what it does for, like, the amount of time you spend in a zone. I don't know how much time in-game passes. Ooh. That is some stuff. Mechanics kit, too. Wood pa Ooh, we got wood paneling now for my station wagon. Let's go. Sticker. It's not really a paint, it's a sticker. Son of a... Pry bar and a mechanics kit. What makes these noises? I want to know what makes these noises. Also, this thing is cracked. Can I be... F can I be... F yeah, I could fix the steel door. I could fix the crack. I don't know how to do it, but I can do it. Yes, now you can be irradiated with style, with pizzazz. Uh, don't think I had to eat that, but... Oh, there's a... There's a building over here.
take the radio apart. At times, this game kind of reminds me of Atomic Heart with like the aesthetic choices and the sound design. But it plays nothing like that game. Chemicals, good. Anything else worth? No, nothing. Let's a go. All right, there's one more building along the way. The trunk is essentially full. It's not good. See ya. I need to get out. Ditch this. Okay. I really want to know what my car is thinking at times, too. Because that little screen over here just says, like, hi, I love you kind of thing. I'm like, yeah, that's cool and all, but, like, use your words. Is it starting? Yeah, the radiation starting. Getting out of here. Alright, now we're going to be going into a very unstable area. We could just drive through. We don't have to stop for anything. We've got tons of gear here. I don't want to stop anywhere yet. I have I have a jumper. Ow. But I feel like doing a jumper right now would not be ideal. So I'm at what 35 of 50 on my juice? Yeah. Maybe fill up on the gas. Prepare yourself. Just top it off. Okay. Here we go. This is going to be something. Someone that fits the style of the car. That's exactly what was needed. Pink flower power and animal stripes? No, thank you. That is a big energy. Touch and go to swift charge in a swift storm. Let's just get out of here as quick as possible. Just follow the road. We're just gunning it and running for it. Skirt. Those guys have a chance of dropping those cores. Just go, go, go. Ow. Thank you. Okay, we're hurting myself. Yep. Gotta watch out for the spikes. Nope, don't have enough of an impact hammer for that building. Tons of radiation. Don't mind me, I'm just driving through. What a lovely soul. Okay. 
son of a gun. Of course it's got to be here, right? Of course. Let's just take down a tree or two, right? Who needs them? I say we go for this thing, whatever this is. and go. Never mind, the storm's here. And now you get screwed over because your car is stuck. You were doing so well. Okay, let's get out of here. Swift storm indeed. God, don't ever do that again on the main road. <laughs> Holy heck. Oh my goodness. I hit one of those left rights. Move, sir. I mean, we could go back for that. It's not as swift as a storm as I thought it was going to be. Maybe because I didn't pull any of the anchors up. Hey, Riker, what is this game? This game is Pacific Drive. A really interesting, atmospheric, uh, roguelike expansion... Roguelite expansion... Not expansion. Exploration. Uh, survival. It's, there's so many genres. It's just good. That's all I could say. You gotta drive around. You gotta collect... You gotta collect materials to craft the things, to build up your base, to build up your car, to go further into the zones to unlock the story. Alright, so now we have to collect... Oh, uh, extremes? We might not make it back from this one. Yeah, this is dark. Yeah. Exactly, Cry. When done right, it's just chef's kiss. Everything's fantastic. We're focusing on... Energy right now. For this stuff. Is anything about extreme voltage? Does that mean there's going to be a lot of those uh, things that just show up out of the ground now? This extreme darkness, though, is also not my friend. I don't like it. Take this on. Okay. Vacuum time. It always sounds like there's a blimp hovering over my head. real. So creepy. Alright, 
Let's see if I can get enough from this big guy. Oh, that's an abductor, sir. You don't want to mess with those. I kind of have to go that way. It's so much worse when you can't see anything around you. As soon as I do this, there's going to be a ton of stuff that just pops up out of nowhere. Yup, look at them. Look at them just showing up out of nowhere. Did they drop anything good? No. Heal up. Good. Too steep. These guys also mess up your car. Not cool. No. I would appreciate it if you let go of my car, sir. This dirt road. Found it. This is the road end, right? No. That's a tree. There it is. The thing with the treads on it. That's a road. So follow this for a little bit. How much energy do I have? To oh, if I get another big guy, that might be all that we need. Something over here. I think I see it up there. It's not creepy at all. You can't see a thing. Go, 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 go. Good. How much juice do we have? Oh, we need another one. That was a tiny one. We need a big guy. I'm not sure I like the auto parker. When it undoes it just from getting in the car, like you're you're not necessarily ready to start moving it. This here I'll stop for though. And also, like, oops. Run. So he's turning off and on the car. No 
another one of these spots, but there's an abductor. Keep the car running. That's it for now. Maybe some computer parts. We have enough lead for a while. Let's go. Gotcha games? Yeah, for, for as much as they are, like, a bad thing, I want to say, I, I don't know. For as much negative uh, baggage that they carry with them, everybody seems to love them. Everybody keeps playing them. Everybody keeps getting gotcha'd. Are you kidding me? It's in the middle of that thing? Why? Oh, it's on the other side of that thing. Why are you following me? guys. We have the juice. Want to get to a main road? Before we do that, jump. Jump the battery. Uh, battery? Where'd you go? I have a battery, right? Okay, good. I have a battery. Could go back on this road here. But this isn't the road. This is. Oh. Oh. Let's get out of here. steering wheel, by the way. That's cool. Let's just heal up a bit. <sighs> now, 
would be the way out to the next town, but I have to extract out of here first, and then we come back to this nonsense. Alright, first thing I want to see. How big is the zone? Not taking that one. No, no. Maybe that's the one to go with. That might be it. I'm thinking we go up through the town. So we get to about here. And I call it in. Okay. Welcome back, Ken. As you can see, it's gotten spoopier. Okay, we don't like those guys, but I want to test something out. Flare gun in my hand. It does get them. Okay, so that's how you deal with tourists. Understood. Auto Parker, I think, has to go. Sounded good in practice. Not much. Not much good has come of it. But yeah, we know how to, now I know how to deal with tourists. Which would be these guys. The ones that have the glowing red in their chest is what I need to farm soon. Get to your waypoint, then call it in. No, they're like mannequin things where... I don't know if you've watched Doctor Who, but there's a, an enemy in Doctor Who called the Weeping Angels, where the more... As, as long as you're looking at them, you have one eye on them at least, uh, they will stay still. Let's do this. to get to that light. Uh, and the second that you take your eyes off them, they will get close to you. And it's in, in Doctor Who, when they touch you, you die. In this game, when they touch you, they explode violently. Don't go too fast. Okay, we're doing good. We're doing good. Storm's closing in real fast. Oh god, we gotta go. Avoid the trees. I think we'll be okay. Get to extract, get to extract. And we're good. Oh yeah, there's a storm. So, you can't see it now, but like, on that little monitor, uh, once you call in one of those extract points, there's a circle, like a ring that closes in on you, like uh, Fortnite or a battle royale. Are you learning a thing or two? My dear uh, the yellow ring is like, okay, prepare to get your stuff rocked, and then the red ring is what like kills you. Let's go through the checklist. First, we dumpster dive. Then we fuel up. Then we make sure our backup fuel is full. How do you escape? So that giant yellow portal, that rift that appeared, you drive through that to get back here. If it closes it on you, you die. 
Uh, your car crashes. It stays there. You can ex you can go back to the map and find your old car and your trunk that has most of your stuff in there. Some stuff disappears. Um, so it's kind of it's like uh, like in Valheim or No Man's Sky or any kind of survival game where you die and your stuff gets dropped. You have to go like loot your corpse. That's basically what you're doing. You're finding your old wreck. Do I have any more new quirks, or do I still have the same? Th I still have three. Okay, I don't know what they are, but also I need. To I think Enra said something about wiring up these things. I don't know how to do that. Oh, that's the floodlights. F. Oh. Yeah. Press F for floodlight. That for that. Yep. There we go. Come on. Okay. So now we repair the car. Uh, front panel's kind of screwed. Everything else can be either replaced. Steel, 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 st not steel. Alright, actually, before that. Oh, that's this. I keep thinking something in my room is beeping. Oh, my wife will ever. Sorry, I'm so sorry. We only had good intentions. I'm never seeing my kids again. Okay. Uh, transfer. This new paint job, new steering wheel somewhere too. Did I put that in the side piece? Yes. Right, new cosmetic. Yes, they are terrifying, and that is a common enemy here. <laughs> it's just like the most basic enemy you encounter. Making sure everything goes here. One chemical. Oof. Oof. I'm going to need more space soon. I have four steels. All right, so this is paint, uh, paint, sticker, sticker, sticker. Paint goes in the paint bucket area, which is, which is right over here. What kind of paint do we pick up? Uh, blue paint. Cool. So we have double blue paints. Triple blue paints. Paint striper. Match a paint. Okay. This is where we put in... Steering wheel. Wood paneling. So now I can actually activate a new steering wheel. And then wood paneling sticker. So my steering wheel is now literal junk. <laughs> and where did that? Oh, I got a bumper sticker. More wood paneling. That's fantastic, actually. How do I fix all those cracks? Uh, ceiling kits. Do I need, like, three ceiling kits because it's so cracked? Nope, just one. It looks terrible, so I'm going to keep it. Anything else with status messages? No. So I need either... One, two, three new steel panels, four new steel panels, and two, is that a fourth steel panel? One, two, three steel, three, four steel panels. I don't want to keep using up all of my chemicals that I find because I can't even build the repair putty. Right, so we're going to have to replace some stuff. Steel bumper. I need steel panels. Uh, steel panel. One, two, three. One, two, three, four. Let's 
so we're gonna take this off. Pop you on. What else needs to be changed? This guy for sure. Take you to here. Junk you. Two more panels. So one of them is going to be the hood of the car. Yeah, we're going to start looking like more and more Mad Max kind of, with everything just being like hodgepodge put together. Last part was this. make a steel door for the back. Hold on, can I build that piece yet? No. I could do fuel things or I could do door things. Bubblegum buddy. What's a bubblegum buddy? Shaggy scrambler anomaly? I don't understand what all these things are. I guess they're later in the game. So what else in the car needs to be fixed? The bumper? Another panel. Did I not replace this panel? Steel bumper, panel, and then the LM, the, the thing. Steel bumper. Another steel panel. guy here. Right. Did I get pink paint out of that? Nice. So if I wanted to, I could go spray paint that stuff pink. Wait, I just painted the gas the cap. Oh. Well now the the pink wagon is is is, is going good. Can I do sleep like that. Okay. Uh back on here. Pink paint. Everything's good. Right. This is where I'm storing my decals, I guess. My stickers. Well, that's that's not stickers. That was something else. Okay. Is pink paint good? No, it was the, it was the first car. Uh, it was the first paint I got for the car, so everything was just pink. I had uh, decals of like uh, flower power, a racing stripe. I'm gonna leave the top undone though. So yeah, I'm just gonna eventually stop painting it and just do more like Mad Max stuff. Like it just starts looking weird. Maybe if I go orange, let's try that on the top. I want it to be the most obnoxious looking car on the uh, in the world, essentially. Paint striper beige. Let's see how beige beige can be. Um, on the gas cap. Right. 
And then match a paint. Mellow, there's been a terrible mistake. What, sh what should remind motorists of the terrible, of the mellow taste of exquisite tea instead suggests sickly sewage. What? There's a sewage caller? Oh, green matcha. Ma not matcha, matcha. Yeah, that looks obnoxious. I'm gonna go with it. Yeah, that... That looks terrible. And I love it. <laughs> it's awful. And I'm here for it. Okay. So, car is essentially repaired except for this thing. The limb pulse emitter. What do I need to build a limb pulse emitter to replace that? I mean, I could. I could, just so that everything's 100%. We really need is this piece here, the matter regenerator. I need six chemicals. So that way when I'm on a road on the road, I put something in there and it heals on the while I'm out on the mission. Or out on the road. So I can have like swappable parts. This looks like the most wonderful station wagon that ever wagoned. Okay. So now that we did that part there. Here's the problem. We just did this. <sighs> so we took this path here, right? We did this before, and it had that crazy piece on it. And then we unlocked this. Now this, this weird... Uh, extreme condition storm thing is hanging out here so you can't just keep farming the same zone over and over that's what it's for so essentially we have to do the exact same run again that's the destination these are all the points we could use to get to it you could choose your own path we are gonna go Stable anchors. We don't have to do anything with the anchors until we get to here if we want to. Not a lot of resources. Tons of resources. Overcharged electricity. It's a new one. Angry abductors. Overcharged electricity. Uh, I don't know if you can see it on the mobile stream, but on the... On the side over here there's a whole list of like what conditions exist in each of these points uh i'm just reading them off so there's low cars right legend is this low vehicle density but high buildings high materials uh low fuel okay so yeah we're gonna do this we're gonna go here and yeah, Mujin. So see, right now it's 7:03 p.m. It'll take me three hours, whatever it says, to get to here. It's gonna take nine hours to get to the destination. So three hours per stop. So by the end of this, it'll be morning. So it's gonna be a night. It's gonna be a purely nighttime run. Eerie darkness, swift storm. Just so. Oh, we're doing the exact same thing again. Alrighty. Can I not do it? Yeah, that's what we're doing. Oh, yeah. So we've mapped that. Car is charged. Everything is good, right? I'm going to do this thing real quick, though. Hold on. Swap these out. Just so that we're all good. Also, what's in my 
area here. So we have a hammer backup. We have a flare gun. We have a backup of that. We don't have a backup light. And we don't have a backup scrapper. Here we go. Scrapper. Rechargeable flare. Just gotta make sure that I'm all ready before I go on my road trip here. Scrapper. Rechargeable flare. I like that you can rotate things around like that. Okay, so we're all good. Everything's fine. Let's take off this Parker thing first. I don't like it. Can I store it? I can't. I thought maybe it would be good, but it's not. Uh, yeah, you need to be that. Is each gameplay different if you were to start over and take the same paths? Uh, yeah, because each one of those, each one of these places, the map is never the same. So, here, I'll show you. So, we just did this then this it's going to be the same like you're going to stop here to go do a thing you're going to hit the town here you're going to be in an extremely dark area here because that is like set in stone this is a dark zone but when you like the pat like if i get to this point and it looks like the exact same map then it'll be the same all throughout except in here let me show you uh can i undo it okay so where the junction conditions are they change all the time. Like, I've I've gone back and done things like this right here. This is completely different now because it's in that super critical spot. It'll have three or four hazards. These are perfectly fine. The story ones seem to always be like they have preset conditions or preset... Uh it's all preset. I didn't set any jumper cables. Oh, boy. We're going to the dark zone. I should go back. I'm just going to leave the car parked right here. This is smart, right? Do I have jumper cables? Just making sure. No, I don't. Be right back. I got to make some jumper cables. Take three, because sometimes the condition when you get into the place, it'll be like, yeah, uh, electricity drains super quickly. That is not cool. Actually, that should probably go in here, my survival kit. There we go. All right, here we go again. Car on. Let's -a go. Love my little driving. My, my terrible steering wheel. My garbage steering wheel. I didn't fix my headlights. <sighs> Gonna be a problem. Hmm. Yeah, so here. Uh, the first time I went through this, overcharged electricity wasn't a thing. Angry abductors wasn't a thing. So every time you go through, the conditions change. Sodium vapor lights. Lead shieldings. Oh, this is, this is what we want. We want this one. Let's go. Ugh. Highway remote damp forest. Oh yeah, okay, this is totally different. So before I was going east to west, now I'm going north to south. So yeah, every single thing, every single run you do is unique. Every single one. To answer your question, Mujin. 
take it all. Ooh, flower power, raspberry, more paints. Need the panel. Take that. That's a lot of stuff. That's a whole lot of stuff, actually. So these guys are great. The trucks you find, they have a whole bunch of uh, stuff for you. Building on the right coming up. Where? Don't do that to your stuff, man. I seize it. Sound good. More flare guns. That sounded like there may be a uh, tourist outside who wants to say hello. Something that took my car away. Might be very sad. No. What was that sound, by the way? It was kind of spoopy. that pop up now. Okay, turn the car on. Park. Go. Slowly. Nice. This is a straight shot. Okay, we don't like that. Anything in this? Yes. A fabric. That's fine. One fabric is fine. Go. said that this would be abundant in res well, it's abundant in resources at the actual place we're going to, not necessarily at this road here. Although... Let's see. Open up. Root headlights. Steel door. If only had the room for it, I would totally take it. I'm already running low on room. I think that steel door would take up this whole piece. I can't even. Oh, that's fine. Oh, no, 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 no. Close your door. Okay. 
don't Dukes of Hazard it. It's fun, but it totally wrecks your car. Straight path through. There's no energy at all here either. On my left side, there should be a building. No. Oh, no, we're getting radiation readings. Keep moving. We're not stopping here. Okay. Building on the right side. Safe. Let's go. Trash can. Give me all your goodies. Uh, is there anything else in here? A Game Boy? I haven't seen one of them in forever. I miss the old days of gaming. That's it for inside here. What about outside? Okay, we run away. We run away now. And now to the actual zone. This was just like the halfway point. Which is nice that they give you some stuff. If you don't close your back door, Mujin, it just stays open, and if you were to back up and, like, hit a tree, it pops off. It happened once before I had my door open, uh, like, my driver door, my passenger door open, and something hit my car, and the door just came clean off. And then when I went to go pick up the door, my game glitched, and my car went back to start, and I had to run across the entire map holding a door. Overcharged electricity. Okay. So I have a feeling whenever I get, whenever there's something here, overcharge electricity. I think that meant that the tourists have electricity on them. Last time, that's what it looked like. Yeah, those guys. Can't go in there, but I'll dumpster dive. It's in your outdoor fridge. Delicious food is what. Yep, that, that's what happened. That is the scenario that unfolded that led to that. And I forgot to close it again. But also... We have a gun now. They don't like flares. For future reference, if you decide to play the game. Oh, that guy can go right straight to hell. That thing in front of me? Oh, no, no. We're not checking out the rest of these buildings. Nuh-uh. Nuh-uh. Not with that thing. I 
Besides, I need science buildings, not barns. That thing will make you Dukes of Hazards so hard. What is this building, though? Repair stop? It fixed some of my stuff. That's wonderful. Uh, take a photo of it. Also, loot, <laughs> loot their wares. Thanks for the free repair. I'm just gonna take all of your stuff. Thanks and good day. So that's what that means. So it repaired my headlight and a little bit of my front. Let's go. So that's that. Learned that today. I mean, could wait a minute there. bulbs. That's all I want is light bulbs. There's another one over here. Oh, I wasn't kidding about it being high in these things. I just want specific items that are difficult to craft because... I need to get pressurized containers, I think, to make light bulbs. And those are really not easy to come by. I mean, if I go straight off the side of the road, right? It saves me from going around the bend. But also, all of that good work that just got repaired. And radiation uh, storm. Doing the thing. We don't even have to be doing this, but I'm doing this because I'm a loot goblin. There's also a science, a couple of science buildings coming up, so maybe I can get chemicals. A hey, use. Get off my lawn. Oh, I forgot to put the car in park. Crap! Oh. Well, that's what happens if you, if you forget to do that. Okay. Talk about forgetting to close your doors. Forgot to turn off the car. Put it in park, at least. Why are you red? I'm genuinely interested in why this is glowing, burning red. Oh, well, that's the flare that I uh, shot off. Okay. There should be... Building.
That's terrifying. Holy shit. Sorry for the salty language, but that, that legitimately scared me. <laughs> that guy was not there two seconds ago. I'm just going to forget about this uh, science building. Maybe go to this science building. An anomaly with a light source. Done. Achievement achieved. God. My car is going to be demolished, isn't it? Electronic stuff. Suck those guys up. Inventory full. These are the things I absolutely need. Chemicals. If I just do this. I 100% need chemicals. Stuff is failing. Get the car. Make a right turn. Ignore the scary, sparky people. Oh, that guy. This guy's not my favorite guy. Got me. We're, we're in trouble, because uh, I'm trying to do something silly here. Going for some juice that I don't need. This juice might not be worth the squeeze. Plus, there's tons of radiation nearby, too. This is... Not again. Okay, the storm is closing in. Not good. Not good at all. Yup, this is not a good spot to be in. Okay, just take the road.
That's the sound of you took too long, buddy. Also, I need to get rid of this waypoint. Uh, remove waypoint. Go. Yeah, so now that storm is coming in now. That's not good. We gotta go. We gotta book this. What would be the best path? Just taking this road straight through. No sharp turns, no nothing. Yeah, this guy. Straight through into the... Oh, no. Just barely missed that, okay. Then when we get to the end... Probably could have stopped for that stuff. There's so many resources here, it's making me sad. I also don't have much room in my car. Why is there a dollar sign at the bottom of the map there? That's an S for the cardinal directions. You are out of your mind. Dollar signs. This stuff coming up out of the row ad. Not cool. Or these sparkly tourists. Okay, we're good. I did not have to go for that juicy little uh, anchor point, but. That's less energy we have to collect throughout. Part one done of, of, oh God. So we just did overcharge electricity. Now we have to do eerie darkness, disruptive discharge, and a swift storm. A sigh. Okay. Put it in park. Get the jumper cables. Close your hood. Fill her up. I have a second gas can in the trunk too, so... This isn't too bad. We just want to get the heck out of here. We're here. We're going to science it up a little bit, and then we're going to go. Yeah. So I have no idea how long it's going to last. Uh... Swift storm and okay, this is already trying to hurt me. Okay. Do not like already. Too much, too close. And of course it does that, and it... Yep. Why wouldn't it? Maybe we leave all this science stuff alone today, friend. I mean, 
somewhere right here, but also right there. This is not smart. took a beating is what happened. That's not cool. Alright, let's just get out of here. I think that's a repair station? No, that's a gas station up ahead. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm in trouble. Big dead. Nope, we get out of here. Storm's already closing in. Yeah, Swift Storm is no joke. Drive through it. Extremely unstable. Go left at the upcoming turn. That's it. So many buildings and so many things left untouched. Oh, it makes me so sad. Done. All right, now for the story mission. <laughs> All this just to get to here. Let's go. Okay, my, the roof of my car looks like it's about to explode. Perpetual stability means we're safe. Let's... I guess make some, some repair, buddy. Six is what I need. It's just a steel panel, right? I need a level two. I need a tier two thing. So I can't. Ow! I mean... I guess what we'll do is we'll just set it up with a crude. Ooh, panel. can't rip it off. I made a mistake. Fancy that. I made mistakes. Mistakes were made. Alright, you go in here, I guess. Yep. For when that door pops off. Hopefully it doesn't. We're already at the point. We don't even have to pick up this, this, uh... Wait, windshield wipers, thank you. We don't have to pick up this stuff here if we don't want to. Just dramatic, just a happy little accident. If Bob Ross has taught me anything. You're right about the sound design cry for rain. It's it is like so good. Don't throw me in the air, please. Oh god. A car! My boy! Father Hill! Oh, 
mean? This is Big Dan's gas station thing over here. No, 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 no. If we're chilling here, we're fine here. That thing is not eating up my tires today. Tier two workbench. I can make a new uh, new door. for a steel door and then make it inside or a steel door. I can't. I have to wait for this thing to pop off first, right? Magically, I could do it now, huh? What do I need for a steel panel? You know what? No, let's um, let's put this crude thing on here. Maybe bring this back home. Yeah. Wow, that's a lot of uh, stuff I have here, huh? Oh, that's fitting. We have to go here, here, and here, but like, what? We have to go on the left side. So it has a specific path it takes. Once it does its thing, now it's going to go the other way, I hope. Good. Yes, leave my tires alone today. Thank you very much. I do have a flat, I think, though. Hold on. Just noticing it now. Yep, that is a flat tire. Uh, do I have the kit that I need? Ceiling kit. Good. Thank goodness for uh, story mission so far, having perpetual stability. Just a little bit of rain here and there, and that's 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 fine. That's fine by me. There's the expansion wall. It separates the outer zone from the mid zone, and more importantly, us from those two idiots. This will get you one step closer to the deep zone. It's far past its prime, so watch your step. Well, I'm not going to go there just yet. I I want I want to snag this last little bit of energy you got here. I don't need it. Stop being a goblin. Just do what you got to do. We have to go down there. That's going to be a fun ride. Okay. So 
nice and easy. not open. Two seems open. What about one? Yep, this is the one. The other one's... What do you think you're doing? Not today, friend. scan that thing. Is that a bubblegum anomaly or whatever it was? A happy hair. It's not going to be so happy when I rip them apart. So now I have to, f I have to scan some things. Uh, Derper? This is Pacific Drive. A pretty ridiculously interesting uh, driving roguelike uh, exploration open world kind of game and I highly recommend it All right, we're gonna go through there but fast maybe the car doesn't go with us the car has to go with us alright so we're through the wall now Everything is so dark. Sir? Right, go through here. What are you doing there, derper? should take that waypoint off. I have to get to, like, here. I think. How old am I? I am pretty old. I am, uh, nearly 40 years old. I don't like these guys. Guys can uh, just not. That took the place of my flare gun, which I need right now. Let's go. Oh, I need those. I need. I need those though. I know, right, Frank? How are we? How are we still alive? to move things around, but could I have to get rid of this steel panel here? <laughs> Makes me sad. Or not. There we go. Is this on Steam? Yes, it is. In the description of my video, I always post uh, where you could buy the games. Whether it's on Steam, uh, Epic, uh, Xbox, PlayStation, whatever. Even if it's on all of them at the same time, I always post the links in the description. So, um, there's another bunch of these guys. 
bunch of these clowns, eh? Wait, these guys drop things. They dropped scraps. If I hit them with the car, they will explode and destroy my car. I've done it before. <laughs> it's not good. Yeah. They don't like flares, so... I either throw a road flare at them, or I just try to chop their chest and scream woo repeatedly. Uh... The ladder never works, by the way. Do I have a flat again? No, I need a mechanics kit. Alright, I'll put the flare gun away. Then we get the mechanics kit. Then we fix... And we're good. Okay, let's go. Tempted to get the plasma, but I'm gonna just not. So tempted to get whatever is in here. leave this steel panel in here, but just make a new one when we go back. Definitely worth. What is it making? Are you attacking my car? That's it. I was going to leave you be. my hand, Spark Tower. I also figure maybe they're giving me all this stuff for a reason? Possibly. I've still got one jumper in case my battery goes real low. I don't have the parts for it yet. I have I have a an e-brake, but my engine is absolute doo-doo butter. I cannot go fast enough to uh to drift anywhere. I've tried. The only time it works is like when I'm it's raining and I'm sliding <laughs> and I'm falling down a mountain. Only time it works. But I can't just be like Tokyo drifting, this kind of stuff. I'm holding down accelerate as hard as I can, and this is as fast as I go. That's it. That was my Tokyo drift right there. It's so not good. Let's put more of this on here. That is a lot of these guys. That's the one we wanted. That one didn't do a thing. Oops. That's trouble. All right. We're gonna go. We're gonna go into this thing. Ooh. That's what we want. Those crystals come out of them. Uh, anything in here worth? Please be worth? Not really. I 
weren't there more of those um, mannequin looking creatures the tourists just a second ago they all go I don't know. I don't know where they went. I'm assuming I make a left out of here. Oh. Where do we go? up here because this looks like road sort of so now I'm driving on the wall where are we supposed to do things I don't think this is the way! I've wrecked my car. Kind of. Okay, that wasn't the way. We're back down here. Oops. Uh, find a way through. Well, that was certainly an experience. supposed to be going right now we just we just cleared this way did I go the wrong way yes everything I just did was totally unnecessary <laughs> as is tradition I think or is this the way we came through? No, this is the way we came through. I'm going backwards. This is the part where I need a clear cut. Go here, do this. Where country am I from? The United States. What about you, Derper? So, we have to go find a way through the wall that way half of my gas. My battery is about to die, but I've got some jumpers. What if we continue going this way? Tried left. Didn't do much. Try right. Oh, more of these guys. Wonderful. Totally not frightening seeing mannequins just randomly stacked up in packs in weird poses. Nope, that's not the way. Okay, here we go. Same, nice. What is this on the map, by the way? That's a science building. I didn't see that yet. Unless it's that piece right there. I'm not going to get out on foot in this place with all these mannequins, these tourists lying around. But maybe that is the way. Oh, well, we don't go that way. I will figure this out one day. What day that is, is, is the big question. So if I make a right here.
Oh, howdy. No thanks. Gotta get the jumper. Jumper is in here. Uh, what is what? That tower there? That is a spark tower. And if I get too close to it, it will try to electrocute me. Unless I take out these power sources right here. One. Two. And then I suck up all of the uh, materials for my use later on. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff in this game that's absolutely terrifying. Um, something just opened the gate. I don't like it. I have to find a way out of this wall, which is driving me mad. Not like angry mad, but like crazy. There doesn't seem to be... It's, it's nowhere that I'm trying to go. Okay, now i got to play the backup game. This is... Yeah, this is not going to go well. 18-point turn incoming. Yeah, I made a... made a boo-boo. Let me try something here. Let me stand here. Yeah. Bring you here, buddy. Thank you. Okay, so we know where it's not. I have to. F Maybe this is a clue? Because it's like solid, solid, broken. I don't know. It could be a clue, it could not be a clue. That seems to be where we came from. Oh. Another one of these pieces. It's in here. Take it. Take it. Uh, get out of here. I'm, I'm confused about where to go. I want to say we go this way, but or would we go? So we're inside the wall. We just tried going down this way. I I wonder if that thing on the map I see with the the structure is above the wall, or if it's inside here. I don't know. Do one more pass of everything down here, which I don't know. It didn't have anything over here. I think we have to go the way that I fell. All the way this way. I am running low on fuel. Let's go fix that. This. That's empty. The big fuel can now. Yeah, we're running low on fuel. We've got a little bit left. Not a whole bunch. Okay, so I'm going to try to go down this area again, but that looks like it's just a steep. It's steep. That's why I'm thinking maybe we go down and around that way. I don't know. All I know is we have to figure out a way over here onto a road. Yeah, that makes the most sense. Get in the car. Drive. Go all the way down there. We have to make a left turn somewhere to get on a dirt road. And then we'll be fine, 
I hold? Question mark? I don't know. I don't know. I saw things in there. And why is my jumper, my battery almost dead again? Do I play Fortnite? I haven't played Fortnite in a long time. Uh, I think for me, my my era of of uh, sweaty PvP games is is well beyond me at this point. I did play it recently when they put no build in. Kind of liked it. Six bulbs. This is this is the most confusing part of the game so far. Everything else has been everything else has been super intuitive and easy to figure out. No build is the best. Yeah, I think it is too. But I don't know. When it comes to like games like that, I'm fine up until like top ten, top top six. And then all of a sudden my nerves get the best of me and I'm like, yeah, I'm too old for this stuff. <laughs> Don't have the reaction time anymore. That's why I used to the only PvP game I really got like try hard sweaty into was Overwatch. And even then I was a tank main. I was a Reinhardt main, so it didn't really rely on re uh, reflexes too much. Oh wait a minute. Yeah, I totally went the wrong way and yeah I'm a fool okay we're doing we're doing the right thing now all right first thing we're gonna do is we have to jump the battery again Had everything get dark there for a split second. That freaked me out. Battery. Juice. Did I forget to close the back door? I forgot to close the back door. What is that dust flying in the air? It's just like dust atmosphere. Like uh, it's it's to make you feel uneasy. It's like ash. Well, oh, you're talking about this stuff in front of me now. Uh, that's part of the map that's made to like make your life hell. It pops up out of nowhere. You hit it. Your car gets wrecked. Oh, we we got through. Okay. Yeah. Wow. I took one wrong turn in everything. I wasted like 20 minutes in there. the thing I think yeah we're good there we go okay we're still not done yet <laughs> my car is about to break that was all just this piece oh man I really gotta call it quits though cause it's like can you just stop and save in here? That is a long ways to go. Uh, oh, no. No. Okay. Hello, Man. friend. Welcome to our side of the wall. Not abandoned saves. The game was saved. If I say quit to menu, 
Progress in the current level will be lost. When you resume, you will load at the start of the level. So that would be this. To save your progress, proceed to an exit or enter a gateway. Save your inventory. You could also select the abandon, save, and quit. Oh, man. It's 10.22. I usually wrap this thing up by 10. So that's why I'm saying, like, I gotta call it here. But, like, to save your inventory, you can also select the abandon, save, quit option. Start of the level would assume this. Save your progress, proceed through an exit, or enter a gateway to save your inventory. You can also select the abandoned, save, and quit up. This is the part that worries me. Car will, your car will not survive on save. Lose most items. No. Saves when you enter a level and does not support manual saves mid-level. If you load or quit without saving, resume at the beginning of this level. Okay. Or you benefit just reduce the penalty and keep all collected items. Yeah. Uh, I want to keep current, please. Cancel. Hold on. Settings. Options. Would that be gameplay? Keep everything. Failed run. Lose most items. This stuff here. We're fine with. Oh wow. You could like do everything. That's kind of cool. Because I'm going to have to quit these games, like, during certain parts, so. But if this is saved here. Quit to menu. Yes. Going to test it out. See what happens. Play the mid-zone crossing. Please be back where I am. Where I just was. Okay, we're good. Yeah, so that saves it exactly where we were. I'm perfectly okay with calling it right there. So, yeah, it is time to call it a night. It is well past 10 p.m. I did start a little late, but that doesn't mean I want to, like, carry it over. But, uh, hey, guys. Thank you for hanging out. Thank you for chatting it up with me. Everybody on uh, the vertical stream, everybody on the normal stream. Um, I'll be back tomorrow, 7 p.m. Uh, Eastern playing more Pacific Drive, exactly where we left off. Um, if you like what you saw, drop a thumbs up, hit the sub button if you're not already subscribed, ring the notification bell, you get alerts when I post content and when I uh, go live on YouTube. Uh, leave comments, share the videos, share the channel. It's the best way to support what I'm doing, and I really do appreciate it. But uh, yeah, until tomorrow, take care, have a good one, and uh, I'll see you soon. Bye.